Sote kumpatie Mungu heshima. Okay. Si tuombe jamani. Tuombe, tuheshimu Mungu tuombe. Baba yetu sheme lele. Tunakushukuru Mungu kwa wema na fadhili zako ambazo Mungu unazidi kutuonesha kila siku. Yehova. Tunasema asante kwa sababu ya uhai na hata kwa sababu ya siku hii ya leo. Tunabikabidhi mikono ni mwako tukiomba Mungu uweze kutuongoza. Na mahali ambapo tumekwenda ni kosimo kutusamehe makosa yetu. Na hata leo chochote ambacho tutafanya wacha iwe cha kukutukuza wewe Yehova. Siku hii ya leo tunaikabili mkono wako kuna wale ambao pengine hawajisi vizuri uwaponye na wale pengine wanapitia changamoto za kimaisha uwaponye katika jina la Yesu Kristo Yehova kibanda hiki tunakiweka mkono wako each and everything that we do let it be of the glorification into uh, into everything we do we do it for your name Father we have not prayed in our is to our Mungu na zidi kutuombea na katika jina la Yesu Kristo tumeomba na atakuwa mimi. Amen. We go cancel your bus today. <laughs> Yes. 
Yes, sometimes you ask yourself, how am I going to live? And what I know is, when God is always leading, there's no way we are going to fail. So making it, you just can't make it without God. Moses did it because God was with Moses. Joshua did it because he depended on God. And therefore, whatever place we are, believing, doing it, believing God, whatever place you are. Therefore, today I want to tell you, Joshua asked, and he told the Israelites, you choose who you want to serve, because me and my family, I will choose God. Those are the words that I want you to think about. You always know that God is always there for us, is always there for the weak, is always there for the poor, is always there for the rich. Despite the class, whether you are a Muslim, whether you are a Christian, God is all for us. Therefore, let us work it through because our God is able. God bless you. God bless you. Keep on watching Parliamentary Service Commission TV. God bless you. Amen. <laughs>
This verse, so let's go to uh, check for me, Jeremiah 29. Jeremiah 29, verses 11. We just read one Bible verse and we kick off the day. Jeremiah 29, 11. What is it saying? Jeremiah 29, 11. Um, it says like this. For I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord. Plans to prosper you and not to harm you. Plans to give you hope and future. Our God is always so wonderful. He loves us. He loves us so very much that he has good plans for us. Plans not to harm us, but plans to prosper us. Therefore, whatever place you are, know that God is always always there for us therefore let us just live by that and uh, keep on keep on doing what you can because no matter how much it is hard no matter how much you may think that things are not working our god has good plans for us therefore keep on keep on whatever the situation whatever hard it is i know the plants are good. Therefore, thank you for listening because uh, I know when we start with God, God is always on our side. So we are winners all through. Thank you so much. God bless you. Have a nice day. Amen. Amen. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.